Hi guys and welcome to Tech Based. In this video, we're going to talk about the latest Windows 11 update for the May release, which is the November 2023 update and the first patch Tuesday for Windows 11 version 23H2. The build that we're talking about today is the build of 22631.2715 or KB5032190. In this video, we're going to talk about briefly what you can expect from the patch Tuesday for Windows 11 23H2 and of course if there's anything new. If you enjoy videos like these, please don't forget to leave a like below and also subscribe to the tech base channel with the notification bell activated so that you won't miss any future uploads like this one so let's begin with the video so one thing that you need to note is that after february 27 2024 there will no longer be optional non-security preview releases for windows 11 version 22h2 only cumulative monthly security updates will continue for the supported editions of windows 11 version 22h2 so in the past tuesday as always we have a lot of security improvements you're going to have in the article below more info about that if some of you want to to learn more about what security improvements were made to the operating system but of course these past tuesdays in my opinion are mandatory if you're using windows 11 daily you need to do these updates because you, this way you'll be protected against virus attacks malware ransomware and so on with this build there's nothing particularly new any changes or other fixes but microsoft is of course expanding the rollout of version 23h2 and its features so if you didn't have copilot or maybe the new file explorer or other features features from the Windows 11 23H2 update, you should start noticing them. For example, on this machine, I have now Copilot and I also have the new file explorer, which is looking pretty good in my opinion. But of course, as I've said, make sure to enable get the latest updates as soon as they're available whenever you're doing updates, even on the main release, because this way you will get all the latest features whenever they're available. So I think that is pretty good. Of course, we also have the Windows 11 service in stack update, which ensures that our device can receive and install Microsoft updates. That is good. The bill for that is 22631. 1.2567. So as always, it's good that Microsoft is improving the Windows update section of Windows 11. We also have a few known issues in this update. For example, one of them being Windows devices using more than one monitor might experience issues with desktop icons moving unexpectedly between monitors or other icon alignment issues when attempting to use Copilot in Windows in preview. This is one of the known issues, but of course there are a few others. So you're going to be able to check them out on the official Microsoft blog post for this new update. So this is basically the past Tuesday update date for the month of November, the November 2023 update. So if you want to see more info about this, you can check out the official Microsoft blog post. You're going to have that linked in the article below. If you enjoyed this video, please don't forget to leave a like below and also subscribe to the tech base channel with the notification bell activated so that you won't miss any future uploads like this one. I was Emmanuel from TechBase. Until next time, have a nice day.